traces of brain surgery dating back 3,200 years, were found in Van. Traces of surgery were found on the skulls of 30 of the skeletons unearthed during the excavations, carried out in the Necropolis Cemetery area in the Kenya Bikon area of Van's Kazakh district, which is thought to date back 3,200 years ago. During the excavations in the Necropolis area, carried out with the permission of the Ministry of Culture and Tourism, and under the chairmanship of the Van Museum Directorate, under the scientific consultancy of Van Using Kiel University, YY Department of Archaeology Assistant Professor Gulen Ayals, three rooms and four whereupon tombs were identified. Traces of brain surgery trepanation were found in 30 of the 400 human skeletons found in these graves. The research team determined that brain surgeries are generally performed on the right, left and back of the skull, and that the surgeries are performed by grooving, cutting, drilling and scraping methods. It was stated that 60% of the surgeries were successful, which shows that medical practices were advanced at that time. A so, Professor, Department of Archaeology, using Kiel University, Dr. Hocken Yilmaz said, there may have been a brain-related neurological disease or epidemic in the region. Individuals were operated when using for methods. 60% of those who had surgery recovered. This shows that the surgeries were performed very successfully. We can say that the only place in Turkey where so many skull surgeries are performed is the Kanya Bikon Necropolis. Patients were given the necessary attention, he said, stating that the bones removed from the graves will be examined in detail in a laboratory environment, Yomas said. Anthropological analyses will be carried out. Their age and gender will be determined. Later, we will conduct studies on diseases infected with bones. By examining the mouth and teeth, we will reveal how individuals feed. We will be working on the diseases they experience. During infancy and childhood, we aim to obtain a lot of information, he said.